SF penalties for failure to provide accurate and timely information. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to deep dive into the important topic of ISF penalties for failure to provide accurate and timely information. As customs brokers, understanding these penalties is crucial for ensuring compliance and avoiding costly mistakes. So, let's get started. First, let's briefly touch upon what Importer Security Filing, or ISF, entails. ISF is a mandatory requirement by U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, for ocean shipments entering the United States. It involves the submission of specific information about the goods being imported before they arrive at the U.S. port of entry. To comply with ISF requirements, importers are required to have a customs bond. A customs bond is like an insurance policy that guarantees payment of any duties, taxes, and penalties to the CBP. It ensures that the government will be compensated if there are any violations of customs regulations. This is where customs brokers come into play. As licensed professionals, customs brokers facilitate the smooth and efficient movement of goods through customs. They assist importers in complying with regulatory requirements, such as ISF, and help navigate the complexities of international trade. Now, let's dive into the penalties associated with the failure to provide accurate and timely ISF information. Penalties can be severe and can have significant financial implications for importers. CBP takes compliance seriously and enforces penalties to ensure the integrity and security of the supply chain. The CBP may issue penalties for several reasons, including late filing, incomplete or inaccurate information, or failure to file an ISF altogether. These penalties can range from warnings and liquidated damages to fines, seizure of goods, and even the suspension or revocation of an importer's customs bond. As a customs broker, it is our responsibility to help importers avoid these penalties. We do this by ensuring that all required ISF information is accurately and timely submitted to CBP. This involves meticulous record keeping, attention to detail, and continuous communication with the importing party. To mitigate the risk of penalties, here are a few key steps that importers and customs brokers can follow. Timely filing. Submit the ISF at least 24 hours before the vessel departs from the foreign port. Late filings can result in liquidated damages. Accurate information. Ensure all details provided in the ISF are correct and match the accompanying shipping documents. CBP may penalize for discrepancies or incorrect information. Collaborate with your customs broker. Work closely with your trusted customs broker to ensure the accuracy and completeness of the ISF. They can assist in addressing any questions or concerns you may have. Remember, compliance with ISF requirements is not just a matter of avoiding penalties. It also enhances the efficiency of your supply chain, reduces the risk of shipment delays, and creates a foundation of trust with the CBP. That's all for today's video. We hope you found this deep dive into ISF penalties informative and valuable. If you enjoyed this content, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on customs brokerage and international trade. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon in our upcoming videos. Disclaimer note below. Until then, have a great day and take care.